Okay, so now we've done the hypothesis testing for a specific coefficient. What is important is that you go and practice for each of the other explanatory variables, meaning for the price of the other beverages, for income, and for time. You need to also do a hypothesis testing using the same process that we have just used. Again, make sure that as you get to the time variable, you will see we are unsure about the sign there. In that case, you will have to use the two-sided test in uh, your study guide and also when you look it up in the t-tables. Also important is that just remember in general when we make uh, assumptions about econometrics like this, we are, using with a, we are working with a specific subset of data. So in this case, even though we might be testing that the price of beer might be statistically significant related to the quantity. Maybe in some other example, it might not be the point. So always remember that we are still working with statistics and we are only working with a certain subset of data. We will never be able to look at all of the consumption of beer together. It's just too big.